Hey yo, it's your boy Ray, and today we're going to talk about my anniversary today, and I'm gonna recap everything that I've done this year. During January, I went to EXA because I broke my hard drive. Yeah, I used it too much, unfortunately, but I got it up and running and got a new one. So I'm safe from that. Nothing of value was lost, at least. And I appreciate that. And this month was my birthday, and it was a chill birthday. It wasn't too bad. It's pretty okay, and I did post a few games like Undertale, Clayton, and some Mimi content. And February, the month of love, it's more of a month of rage because I did play Overwatch. That wasn't great. The lag was agonizing. I hated that game. I hated my internet the most, but still, Overwatch sucks. <laughs> and I got an upgrade for Rick. I finally used the art, and I really like it. I like using it. Don't get me wrong, old Rick is gonna come back at some time soon. It's just that I'm l I want to use the new one more for now. And who knows, if I'm feeling nostalgic, I might bring him out sometime. And this is the month where I set up my commissions. I was trying to prepare for it, but for some reason, PayPal is giving me a hard time. It's not great. And also, the thing that I'm signing up on, it's too professional. It's, I, it's too much for me. I gotta learn how to do taxes and stuff. Uh, and yeah, I'm not ready for that yet. And this month, I just produced some Darkwood content and more Undertale content. As you can see, I'm just doing a slideshow of the art that I've made as well, so you can catch up on what I made. One, some are pretty cursed, really cursed. Some I don't want to show on YouTube, and uh, some and they're not that bad. They're getting better. And March, I just made more Terraria content and more Undertale content. Mm, nothing big happened this month. It's just your normal upload time of Ray. But on April, something big happened. Besides the Pino comic, which is like the beginning of my voice acting arc. <laughs> we'll get to that later. But anyway, I made the VTuber Battle Royale and I can't believe that video went really well. It's well put together. I love the video so much. It's wonderful makes me really happy away from their fire some people are acting like gremlins again seems like the gremlin disease is activated real fast heck even ben the robot suddenly went all gremlin ben had some super powered weapons i have no idea why he's not using them hp iris it basically scales how much i'm capable of doing some great edits on something so limiting it's just a Hunger Games simulator. It's very simple, you just narrate the stuff and you're done with it, but I want to do something more with it. After editing that, I developed a better way of editing stuff, and I'm really proud of that. It did take a lot of time and energy though, so that's why it took a break at May. It was mentally taxing, it was really hard, very difficult to pull through, because it was too much. I'm also dealing with a lot of stuff during this month. But on June, I finally worked with some commissions, and I'm very happy about that. Thank you for your support. There are the two people who first commissioned me, and I'm very happy to work with y'all. So I made two pieces of art for Ryoko, two pieces of curse art to be specific. I love it so much. And they're also pretty detailed, and I wish I could work on more cursed art soon. For Neo, I made a music commission for them, and that is this song. I finally got the ability to play, to make music. I was really happy because um, I suck at making music. I can't play any instruments, I can't sing or any do anything musical. But when I got a hang of music theory and DAWs, a bunch of those programs like the VSTs and the sound fonts, I finally got something going. I finally made some music. And this is the first music I made, aka Serenity. 
I love this song. I, it makes this is the song that I'll play anytime because it's so calming to me. And since I got two commissions done within the month, I managed to buy Minecraft. And I, that was the best investment I've made in my life because uh, I'll talk about it more, but it made me a lot of friends, grew my relationships, and yeah, makes me happy too, real happy. At July, I was invited to Ninja's Minecraft server. It was wonderful, everything was chill. I played with Ninja a couple of times during the year. Little pink steps going up to eyes. <laughs> it was really fun. He, he, I terrified him a little bit. It was amazing. It was an amazing experience to play with friends again. I barely get to play with friends because you can't really play with others if you don't really have others available to play. This opportunity of getting Minecraft and playing with friends and also practicing Minecraft, I was very happy that I managed to have an, another opportunity to play with friends. Yeah. I also made my old videos into shorts again and I realized shorts aren't my thing. I didn't like shorts. It was eh. didn't like it. Not fun. It was too grindy, too simple, it wasn't fun. My recycling content isn't my thing but I have to do it. Heck, I made a bet with someone. Whoever gets uh, 1k subscribers wins, but apparently I'm not sure how it's going for them, but for me, I'm not going to win that race. But maybe next year, maybe I'll win the race. Who knows? You know who you are. And in August, I made Tragedy, and that was the best song I've ever made. I love tragedy. It, it encapsulates my ideas pretty well. The concept of having a storyline for one song. I, I love it so much. And I, I love the first part of, of tragedy. It's great. It's definitely sweet, melancholic. I used the creep chord progression for that, which fits so much. I love it. It took me a lot of time and energy too. That was my limit for now. Maybe next year I, I can do better? Not sure. We'll see. Crystal Cat VA invited me to their Minecraft server. Got him back here. Fuck! I almost died. Give me a minute. <laughs> I haven't mentioned. I haven't told about the whole story yet because I'm still editing the video. But let's say it was a greatest experience I've ever had. I met a lot of new friends. I had so much fun playing with them and it was a great experience because I never re I never realized how much I got better with socializing with people and I'm very happy. After I showed off a little bit of Minecraftage, I also joined another Minecraft server from Dino Solo Lofferus. Maybe I said that wrong. But Dino invited me to their Minecraft server. It was fun. It was crazy by the way. I can't show most of the stuff but if you see this uh, screenshot that I present to you, yeah it's that. It's crazy. <laughs> I know. I'll be making videos of that soon if I finish my Minecraft my Crystal SAP video. But we'll see. In uh, September I just posted my Crystal SMP trailer. I only released the trailer because that's the only thing that I can muster for now because things are too much. Uh, there's a, I'm working on a lot of things right now and I don't have time for editing and I wish I had more time for editing but hopefully I'll finish it. And in October I posted a silly thing at Lee's server and I voiced one of his OCs, he's Elijah, he's great. You should go check out Lee's stuff, he's also amazing. I developed a voice acting arc in this era because I did some side gigs with Lee and his friend Wiggly and also his other friend, Matas. We did some voice acting together and so far it looks great. It's fun voicing stuff for them. And I produced this video called the GPS. <laughs> <laughs> I love voice acting. I wanna do more of these. Eventually making adding more to my portfolio and I'm also trying to practice. And on November, 
there were no vids at that time because I was so super busy. But I w was invited to Lee's Minecraft server. It was a lot of fun. I had tons of fun playing with Lee and the rest of his friends. And yeah, I love it. I also socialize greatly too. I want to play more on these Minecraft servers. I still haven't finished the goals that I have for the Crystal SOP because I have a ton of goals in this servers, but I need a lot of time. So in conclusion, uh, but this December is really rough because uh, I have to do a lot of things. Uh, things are getting a lot difficult, so I have to focus to finish them. So yeah, go follow these lovely people. They supported my channel greatly and. Also, thanks to Dart, Dartle, for playing with me with Undertale, making the Undertale series, Deltarune series. You haven't seen that yet. I played Deltarune. That's another series coming up. But yeah, thanks to Dartle for playing with me. Thanks to Neko Badabochi for also playing with me and inviting them to their Discord server. Thank you for Crystal for inviting me and giving me the opportunity to connect with more people and also have fun with everyone and I th thank the same for Dino thank you for giving me a bit, an opportunity to play in your Minecraft server and also to get along with you and Orange maybe that's the wrong word for his name I'm not sure I'm sorry for misnaming you and I'd like to thank Lee for giving me the opportunity to voice act one of your characters. I hope we could I could voice act more I could voice him even more next year. I would be happy to do that. Uh, thank you for inviting me for the Minecraft server. It was a lot of fun. I like hanging out with you, talking with you. It's, overall it's a great thing. Thank you for Wiggly for supporting me and also playing with me as well. Yeah. I had a great time talking to you with Lee. It's wonderful. And I uh, hope we get, get to hang a lot more soon. And thank you to Nyanja. Uh, Nyanja, you basically invited me to my very first Minecraft server. And I can't forget about that. I really am happy about that opportunity. And also to the opportunity to hang out with y'all, with Nova, with Thor. It's wonderful. Thank you. I really appreciate it. And yeah, I uh, thank you to all these people who I will mention at the list because oh god, there's too many. I I have to remember this later on, but there's a lot of people that I'm really thankful for for this year and for the whole channel for supporting my whole channel, me as a person as well. And yeah. Thank you. And of course, let's not forget Thank you all, my audience, my crewmates, my quartermasters, everyone of you who stayed this long to watch my videos, to be patient enough to wait for another upload of mine. Thank you so much for sticking around. I really appreciate it. It really keeps me going. It makes me very encouraged to keep going on making more videos, you know. And that's it. See you next year, y'all. Hope I can make more videos.